Hi there, I'm Chris May, host of This Day in Weather History. It's a podcast from the Weather Network and now in its second year. Thank you for supporting it all the way through today. Um, you remember back in the day, that old television show, Lee Majors, uh, The Six Million Dollar Man? <laughs> What can you get for $6 million these days? You can't get a cleanup from a major hailstorm. Today we're talking about the billion dollar hailstorm that hit Alberta in the year 2020, still today considered the fourth costliest natural disaster in Canadian history. The size of the hailstones were up to tennis ball size in many cases, and they were falling at 80 to 100 kilometers per hour. The hardest hit areas were uh, areas of northeastern Calgary, Airdrie, as well as Rocky View County. And in some cases, there were homes with that aluminum siding along it that it just shredded. It was stripped from the sides of the buildings. It did that to homes. It punctured holes through cars. So much was heavily damaged. In all, there were 70,000 homes and vehicles that were damaged in this melee. In the end, and I called it a billion dollar storm, total estimated damages amounted to just over one and a quarter billion dollars. So I said it was the fourth. That puts it fourth place behind the 2016 Fort McMurray fire, the 2013 Southern Alberta floods, both of which I've covered on this day in weather history over the past year. And the other one that I've also covered was the 1998 ice storm that affected all of Eastern Canada. All of those stories can also be found by going back into the archives and checking them out on this day in weather history.